the U.S. military's Gremlin X-61A drone has completed its third test. Dynetics, a wholly owned subsidiary of Lidos, said that during the third test flight series, the Gremlin's air vehicle, GAV, and Gremlin's recovery system flew three more times. The system has totaled seven flight hours during the month of November. The test took place at Dugway Proving Ground in Utah for the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA. In December, DARPA said the X-61A Gremlin drone failed to attach itself with the arm extended from the cargo bay of the C-130 plane nine times. This test series focused on two objectives, demonstrating the automated, manual safety behaviors and continuing progress toward multiple aerial docking attempts. The safety behaviors demonstrated safe operation of the X-61A GAR on the range in close formation with the manned C-130 recovery aircraft. Our innovative safety functions are a critical part of the Gremlin system, said Tim Keeter, program manager for the Dynetics Gremlins team. With five total flights to date, almost 11 hours logged in flight and a thorough, disciplined test plan, we are pleased with the safe operation of our system. That's a significant milestone for Gremlins. After the second test in July, the Dynetics Gremlins team was able to continue progress towards multiple aerial docking attempts with the Gremlins Autonomous Docking System, GADS. The team ultimately achieved the program's first ever aerial docking attempts, nine attempts in total, with each attempt coming within inches of capture. Our goal is to advance as far along on our test objectives, collect data, and thereby mature the system as much as we can, said Keita. The ultimate program goal, of course, is safe, reliable airborne recovery at a 4 and 30 minute rate. While we have not yet achieved that objective, every time we fly, we get better. Similar to July's test flight, the three GAUs were successfully recovered on the ground using the parachute system. All four GAUs are presently being prepared for the next series of flights in early 2021. Dynetics was one of four companies awarded a Phase 1 contract for the Gremlins program in 2016. Phase 2 was awarded in March 2017 to two of the initial four performers, and Phase 3 followed in April 2018, when Dynetics was named the top performer. The maiden flight of the X-61A occurred in November 2019, flying as predicted with no anomalies in the operational system.